Yeah, so our new engine came in. Don't do that at home, kids. You don't get an undercoat plastic. Week two, what we got going on, Mike? How you guys doing? Uh, I'm doing a brake job on a C43. And uh, Joel's over here doing a, looks like the drive shaft blew up on this one, put a hole in the oil pan. So we had to drop the whole front subframe, replace the oil pan. He's cleaning all the old gasket off right now. Looking pretty good though. Now we let her soak. Uh, intake manifold gaskets. Yep. I need a new gasket for this. Yep. Um, yeah, so our new engine came in. Came out of an S class. We're gonna have to swap a couple things over, but looks like it's gonna work. Don't do that at home, kids. tech start uh, last week his name is Joel I used to work with him uh, at a couple dealers he's got seven plus years of Mercedes-Benz experience um, and he's actually doing this big job right now but here's Joel hey like Mike said I'm Joel uh, yeah we worked together for a long time uh, wasn't a big fan of the dealership but you know this is a great place to be and really happy to see what we can do here okay. My tools are right here, it's nice and easy. I'm on camera again. What are we doing? Talk to me. Yup. Look at that. Hey, look. Definitely bright. It's not right. You must know what you're doing, huh? Apparently. You want to show them the steps? Oh, the steps. I have shit everywhere. Man. You guys want to see the steps, huh? Ooh. Yeah. Baller, bro.
get that transmission for that 2010 ML. Just came up. Got the CLA 250 in the shop for a rear differential. Just came in. Got a CLS 550 in here for a right front axle seal. This is that GLK we just finished. We're actually still waiting on a cap, but we put in the old cap for now. We got my man Joel working on the SO. Finally got the engine in. So we get this S550 in. Extended third party warranty. We have a bunch of stuff going on with this thing. Motor mounts, water pump, upper timing covers. We're gonna see what that warranty wants to cover. They're gonna be sending out an adjuster. We got my whip. Just got these wheels painted black. One, two, three. You got selfie mode here. It's actually working this time. One, two. Well, why ain't it going? Only you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be so proud of me. One, two, three. New diff. Thanks for good progress. The engine's in. Let's see what a lot of smaller things. So the uh, second one worked out, huh? Yep. Being real careful with these old injectors. Quickest I've ever seen you work. Yeah. Somebody's gonna do it around here. I'll never forget when I started working. Worked at a Benz dealer, dude. This new guy was like, yo, there's oil leaking everywhere. You see that? He undercoated it. Come on, he didn't. Undercoat the most most important part. You don't gotta undercoat plastic. Yeah, dude. it's a little messy. Wonder why they did that. Yeah, that's weird. I feel like they missed the most important parts. They did. They, Is that the frame? Look. They just they just coated plastic. Plastic. And the diff cover. And the diff cover. <laughs> and he probably paid a couple hundred dollars for the undercoat. I want to know who But like the stuff that's actually resting isn't coated. What else? There's nothing else undercoated. Yeah, look at the subframe. It's getting a little chunky <laughs> up in here. So what we got going on here, Mike? Right front axle seal, that's what the dealer said. How you doing? Good. Thank you. Just a little wet. Yep. Finally done. 
I'm going to give you guys a walk around and show you guys what me and Sebastian did to it. So we installed some aftermarket headlights. As you can see, we installed a steel bumper and some uh, fog lights with the old blacked out grill. Also with this bar, we were supposed to get a light bar, but supposedly that they didn't have them. Um, the customer self-picked out all this stuff. So here we got the electric side steps. See, as soon as you open the door, you can't actually see, but there's actually a light shining underneath. Goes right back up. We also replaced these panels right here. There was actually some front bumper damage right up here. We replaced, uh, this is all brand new, freshly painted right here. This was all cracked and smashed up and scratched up. Uh, we tried to buff out the scratches the best we could. Actually, it looks 10 times better. A couple deep scratches, but there was a lot of scuffing going on right here. Um, also buffed a little bit of this door. And we got the rear bumper. With some reverse lights. And also aftermarket tail lights. Customer is going to be getting a six inch lift and aftermarket wheels, some bigger tires and bigger wheels. Should look nice. Be dropping Mike's personal number in the description if you need trucks modified. <laughs> okay. Show you guys my sick security cam setup. are basically invisible. Yo, check this out. Mercedes is asking me what percentage of your work Wireless. on MB vehicles. I'm showing them my work, bro. You see this? What's up? Mercedes Benz is asking me what percentage of my work is on MB vehicles. We got an F-150 outside. We got a Ford F-150 outside. We're exclusive. You got an F-150 outside. So the F-150, we're exclusive, yeah? Look at that. We reached it. You just lied. Huh? You lied. Lied about what? You We're said exclusive, exclusive to Mercedes Benz. Yeah, that's our secret menu that nobody knows about. <laughs> <laughs> Showing them my wiring. Yeah. Look at this. It's professional, man. If you need security cams installed, you know a guy now. You know a guy. Sometimes. Let's see what Mikey's up to. Hey guys, it's Mike. 